How's it going by? David Hedge here, and today is Saturday, August 7th, 2021, and I'm here at the Berglund Center, Big Lick Comic Con, and I'm going to be here for both days. Let's check it out, see what there is to see, all the sites that are associated with Big Lick Comic Con, and join me back here when it's all said and done. I'll give you a little rundown of what I picked up and what my thoughts are, so let's go. that you love in Roanoke, Virginia. It feels good, right? Absolutely awesome. Thank you guys so much for being here today. It's truly awesome. Have you had a good time? What? Horrible. You're not building that suit yourself? I'm not. There's like a whole team. Other people doing. build it so much better. <laughs> so we thought that Emily could be up here while we're happened at Big Lick Comic Con in Roanoke, Virginia, Berglund Center. They hit out of the park. Like, I am thoroughly uh, thrilled of how everything looked. Uh, my only complaint is that the aisles could have been a little bit wider. And I know the reason why they had the aisles 
configurated the way they did is because when they got all the vendors come in and all the artists to commit to coming in to the con, um, Delta variant and Delta Plus variants weren't a thing yet here in the Roanoke Valley or in Virginia for that matter. And so they were able, they wanted to try and make up for last year not being able to have it and uh, this year have it be just a great uh, time for everybody, for the entire family, and a turn to get back to normal. But unfortunately, with the variants and all, the aisles were a bit claustrophobic at times, which were, it did affect me a little bit, but not as bad as I thought it would. It would have been a lot worse if I didn't have the vaccination or anything, but I was wearing my mask, stayed, my, uh, stayed safe, sanitized when I, like, when I could and all that, so... Uh, but I had a great time. Uh, Cindy was able to pick up some cool stuff. I was able to find some great stuff as well. A lot of pops. A lot of pops. Uh, good amount. Of, like, if you want comic books, there's a lot of different vendors here. Everything from dollar books to high dollar books. And you name it, they had it. All sorts of vintage action figures and decals and stickers and buttons. And you had advertisements for haunted mansions that are coming up. And... Uh, it was just a great time. Plus, the guests were amazing. Um, I was able to get the uh, the gentleman, the voice Joey Wheeler, to sign a pop figure. So that was really cool. And uh, I was able to get a lot of stuff that I can't remember his name off the top of my head. Got him off a person uh, for that. But um, I'll put his name in the comments below so you know that I remember. I just can't think of it right now. But I had a lot of fun. And... It was a good time. It was a chance to get back to normal, even though some parts of my life can't get back to normal as much as I would like them to be. This is one of those that I can feel comfortable being able to go to a con and wear a mask and try to be as safe as possible, uh, especially in a big area like the Bergen Center. So thank you guys so much for checking out this video. If you like it, definitely click the bell above never miss an upload like share comment subscribe all the stuff you need to do with youtube to get out there that house hedge gaming is here for all your gaming and wrestling needs and if you use anything that you want to see any games you want me to demo by all means let me know i'll look up the game and if i can grab a copy of it i'll be more than glad to give it a shot because i am always looking for another great game to play so thank you guys so much and until next time stay safe and take care